One very occupied father as he is in his business, in his shop, in his factory, one day comes home. So his son comes and he taps him. And he says, Daddy, can I ask you a question? I'm busy, man. Can't you see I'm busy signing this? I've got to sort out this. I've got to pay this. What do you want? Talk quickly. It's too occupied, too busy. The child, wait, and when, my, when, my, when will my father come? Like the poet says, that if you sympathize in with that young child who has lost his father and you call him an orphan, the poet says, come I tell you about another orphan who has a father but is too occupied in his shop. I think, look at this child with the same eyes of sympathy. He also has a father, but in essence he's deprived of the love of a father, the compassion of the father. That father's morning and evening, day and night is in that shop. What is he? Talk quickly. Oh my father, how much do you earn per hour? What do you want to know how much I earn? You got your school bag, you got your, your, your toys, you got whatever you want. What, what do you want to know how much I earn? Okay, I earn 20 rand an hour. You happy? Go. The child says, one more question, Derek. What is it? Can you borrow me 10 rand? You're asking me like as if you are my father. What do you want a 10 rand for? I just gave you money yesterday. Go from here. The child turns away and he goes and he goes to sleep. Puts his head down and he falls off to sleep. As the moments pass and the father's tension settles, the thought crosses his heart, after all, it's my beloved, my son. If I can't give him money, who is going to give him? So he comes to him and he taps him and he says, My son, my beloved son, sorry, tell me what you want. You want a tendron, you're heavy. So the child lifts his pillow, takes the tendron and he puts it under the pillow. And while the child is doing that, the father sees another tendron. So he says, Oh my son, you've been asking me for one tendron. I've given to you, I apologize, but I see you have another tendron. He says, Oh my father, I have been saving money. And now that you have told me that you earn 20 rands an hour, I want to ask you, can I buy one hour from you tomorrow so that you can come home early so at least I can have one hour with my father after five months. Oh my father, you are too occupied. You are too engaged. Your money means everything to you. You left Allah, you left us also. Brothers, if this masjid can cry, if this Quran can cry, Wallah, it will cry in such a way that no baby has cried. You left Allah, you deserted Allah, you abandoned Allah. Now you came on to us, you left mummy, you left me. Your shop, your empire, your kingdom knows no bounds. So here is my 20 rand. Can I put it in your pocket and humbly ask you and implore you, please come home early tomorrow, Appa. I want to sit with you. May Allah let this incident penetrate into our hearts and our minds. And may He grant us contentment to devote the remaining part of our life to His obedience. Wa akhiru ta'wana and alhamdulillah rabbil alameen. Oh, mm -hmm.